Welcome guys. Let's talk about something that is very, very, very important. Let's talk about the cryptocurrency market. So if you see the cryptocurrency market has been bleeding for a, for a while now. There are many of the coins that has been going up and down and, uh, and up and down and all that. So the question that is not being asked is what does the cryptocurrency market hold? We've been seeing ICOs popping left and right and a lot of people have been talking about cryptocurrencies and this and that and all that. So when we are talking about an ICO, more time, well, one thing people don't actually uh, look into is the, the reason why an ICO should be conducted. You know, if you look at the VC world, you don't just come up to meet a, a, a VC or an angel investor and tell them that you want funds. They have to be cogent reasons why you need a fund. But uh, as we in the crypto space, people just have an idea and they tell you that we want to raise money. And then they tell you, okay, how will your platform be the next few years? They tell you, okay, we have a buyback plan and all that. So the question you be, you think you'll be asking is, okay, why will many ICO projects fail? We'll talk about that in the next video. But today I have a, a platform I want to talk about. It's called Friends. Now I want to say this disclaimer: uh, this is not a financial advice. This is not a sponsored review. I just um, saw this platform and decided to uh, talk about it because one of my uh, someone in my in Telegram asked me to talk about this platform. So I will be um, I will not be talking much about this platform per se. So this already they already have a, a, a success story. They've been there for two years now, and they had uh, they have offices in Ma in three places: Madrid, Italy, and one one other place. And they work with some of the, as you can see from their uh, their previous clients. You can uh, on page twenty five. You can go through it. You can see some of the clients they have worked with in the past, and then um, the value proposition they actually bring in uh, into the space and how it actually works. So I'll I'll, be, I'll just be talking about the how uh, the fr how friends work. So you've seen uh, platforms like Instagram or Snapchat where people just take up the uh, the phone and they're like, "Hey, I'm in this restaurant, just chilling out." I know that. I know that. So what these guys want to do is, you know, on uh, these days now, a lot of things are happening on social media. More people are spending people are spending more time on social media than they actually do with uh, anyone else. So friends, they've took it upon themselves and say, "Okay, why don't we?" Incent uh, give some incentive to people rather than just take photo and just to boost the ego up. Why not we uh, make this digital stuff like the photo and the video? People, why not people who have influence? You see someone, let's say, uh, I was discussing with someone one time and I said, if you want to write something, I said, okay, uh, maybe you want to write something of uh, a wisdom quote like, um, Quitters never win and winners never quit. Such a kind of quote that can inspire someone. I said, why is it that you have to put your own... It is not, this is not just you de designing a picture and just writing text and uh, picture. You snap a picture and then you just put it. I said, why are you doing like this? He said, if I just if I write winners don't quit and quitters don't win, nobody is going to give attention to it. So what, what will happen? Include your photo. You use that to draw attention. So they are using the the, the model to actually uh, draw attention to people. So you be asking how would they do that? The first thing is, uh, you know, humans are very corny. So a platform like uh, Steam, Steam is and the rest. Okay, you are you, you get paid when you write articles and all that. Do you know that there are people who are not very creative who will not write their own original articles? They will just go on the web and just type something that is random and. Just come and paste it on Steemit. So Steemit will for Steemit to be very very effective, so that they will not, uh, uh, so that they will not actually have um, cases and all that. What they will have to do is that it's very simple. They will have to have algorithms that will have to validate that to say okay, this content are coming from the original content, or if they're not coming from the original content, are they quoted and, and all that. So what Friends is doing is. When a content is put on the uh, the friends uh, network, they will have to uh, there are there are validators or approvers that will have to validate and say okay this is coming from the original source and all that and 
not only validate that it is original, you have they will have to validate that first uh, is of high quality, then it's of original. Then they want to validate also if it's in line with the task that uh, the people want them to do. Because when you go on Instagram, um, for example, you see, um, let me wole arole. Let me see. Our Instagram. Okay, let me use this guy as an example. So this is a uh, a very very popular uh, figure in Nigeria. So when you see a person like this, you can see what he, what 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 he put there. He's putting something to maybe say. Okay, let's let's play this video. Um, sorry guys, I just want to drive home the point so you So you can see what was written here. You can carry out visually all your financial transactions on the new Kickstarter mobile app from the convenience of your phone, no matter where you are, without stepping into a bank. Our new mobile banking app we makes banking more accessible and more convenient because you can easily open an account instantly, bank on the go with our Kickstarter chat bot. And you can see some of the features: know your relationship officer. Book a fixed deposit instantly. Make I know that. So you can see the link, uh, Kingston Banking and all that. Now you can actually see it's coming from a uh, figure here, and you can see the the views. And then if I log in with Instagram now, I can also see the likes and the engagement and all that. So with friends, it's very very uh, it's very very simple. There are many people now. Not everybody is a, uh, is, a um, is a personality that can actually gain such uh, maybe audience. Not not, not everybody can, that can actually gain an audience that will actually pay them to do uh, stuff like this. So what this platform will do is let's compare this. How many followers does he have? So he has over 600 uh, 600,000 followers. Now there are people on Facebook who could have maybe 20 friends or maybe a few followers. Now they post something most times like let's say for example maybe they see something online they're like this thing is very very helpful to me and they start telling others about uh, that platform. That word of mouth because people are no more spending time offline most times. It's mostly on the internet. So people tell you if they are feeling bad, they tell you, or they, they, they go online. If they are feeling good, they tell you. So everything is going online now, whether bad or good. So you why not use, uh, why not turn that stuff and turn it around so that people can actually make money with it. So that is what Friends is all about. So guys, I uh, don't want to make this video long. This is, this is another. That is what they are. Uh, that is what they are doing. I'm just explaining so that you at the end, uh, you that is watching this video, you can know that uh icos most times if an ico ends with uh, uh uh okay we want to raise money this no no no. an ico should have utility and one of the ways for you in my ico course i told you that one of the ways for you to know that an ico has value is an ico that not only engages businesses an ico that also engages individuals 
check platforms like Facebook. How are they succeeding? Pla uh, 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 Facebook engages uh, uh, in businesses. It also engages individuals. So if the business can actually engage, uh, uh, if if the, if the business can actually engage other businesses for one form of service or the other, it's going to make very good sense because businesses money have to flow, and then it has to engage people. So in the next video, I'll tell you why many ICOs will actually fail. So guys, this video has been very helpful. Hit the subscribe button. Thank you.